Or it is just that agent change. A lot of players up on C holding to try and stack it out. Well, Ryan, it looks like there's going to be a bit of a fight on C and D, but it's not going to work. And down on them in just a second, you're really limiting your opponent's options. And Big were so conscious of potentially being faked out, but they still end up losing out on that duel. The grab well down, and well, it's not going to stop a plant. It's trying to get him dragged into that shock dart. And although Dastrian takes a bit of damage, he's still good to go and get this plant down. If they can stop it, they'd win the game right here and now. Win the round, at least. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. But it doesn't look like they can. Retaking in. Difficult to do. Losing players left, right, and center. And now Obnox is the last man alive. Look at the HP. Both of these are just one hit, but they are the ones to find the hits and find... Point, I think, being just that maybe you delay the time a little bit more. Aslan, oh, he's being caught. Plant and these weak weapons now actually worth a lot. Oh, but Boo gets caught in just a spray down from Gop B, <gasps> holding on for Utility Dream Ass. This is a lovely lurk. He's able to get the kill on Scott B before Obnox could check him all the way from stairs. Now, a two versus three, still doable for Big. They have a zero point that could close down some of these players. Like, Fekiu is on such an angle, they must expect it, and Obnox might be able to find an opening. That was smart play by Fekiu to just tuck in the corner, though. Really bait him out, let him use the knife, and then destroy him. Kaspa's got to clutch this one, and Fekiu's too quick on it. Three fight. And actually, there's a lot of util being used up by London United. They've caught Gobby. Oh. Picked off, and anybody that else that's trying to play in close, a rolling fun is going to catch them. Obnox gets all five suppressed. He's trying to go aggressive with that null command, and that's like just watching this angle with the operator. A oh, bad play for Aslan. If he can pick up one, but the trade is instantaneous. The bullet barely left the chamber, and he was already down, pulled back. And he's going to try to distract as best he can, making the noise up inside of heaven, even grabbing a kill on Emulsi, allowing the flank of Casper to come through. He was just buying time for his teammate. Hunter's Fury using flat. What? What? Where was the dash going? Aslan is absolutely mad. He got tagged as well. Someone I had the pleasure of working with for a little bit, and he... Think, I feel like if you try and play this style, you're just going to fatigue yourself. Uh, fight on the God B. Is he ready for it? Well, it, it doesn't matter. Could be there to confirm it. The tagging is coming through. Boo just trying to wall bank. Mind games in as well. Big wanted to catch this. That is insane. Nasty. Like, that is that is uh, brutal. Late like, trying to catch the deep one players. It gets two on the tag. And Twister finds an opening, but still. They've ended up with good value out of it for sure. I like this adaptation. London United, they leave completely. They're not going to be pigeonholed into sticking on that seaside and fighting for the control. They're going to move to mid and try to catch someone on the lurk. That's where Malsey comes in, but he's dropped. Walking up through mid, it's not a gap that they're unaware of. Big are completely conscious. Oh. Leeds takes the attention away from Dream Mass as well. He's pushed right up. Yeah, I guess maybe it gives them some dividends past what they were expecting, give Dream Mass the lurk, but now he's down and it's all left on to Boo. Yeah, about as you expect. Seven to two. Big. Oh, look, they found their second round. They've done it. Well, Shock Dart's down to destroy some util in mid double bounce, so you get the audio cue. Look down on mid, Recon about to give some info, but no idea that Malsi's in the corner. He snuck himself away, but he's being spotted. I think his skin was just seen as he started to come around the corner. Gobby's going to be more than ready for that, but he'll only find the one. Twiston applying the pressure, attempting to delay the plant when it comes through. Where does Destrian go, though? He has no way out. Either face Twiston or Aslan. Either way, it's a death sentence. And Dreamass has made a ludicrous play, popping down his lockdown to try and make this work. And, well, not surprisingly, it hasn't. The one thing I'll, I'll note here is that he actually knew that he couldn't be... Now, Gobby's still over on this angle. I've changed it up, but he's caught by the attacking... So well, time and time again. But in those moments, we've seen big leaves leave massive gaps, and this time, they've in fact taken space. You are divided. Got big immediately reset on that. Casp's possibly thinking about the push here. He's left Twiston alone, but I guess they oh, knew yeah. he could hold on to that all by himself. Cosmic Divide on the other side oh, no. doesn't really hold them back, though. The plant has to be found. Two seconds left to get it in, and there's no time, really. If they can drop Mulsey, if they can just kill him now and stop it, but they can't! It's been planted, and although he's caught on the way back, there's an opportunity for Dream Ass in the 1v1, and he's got it done! Dream Ass wins the round! 8-3, to three. London United! The four players wrapping around the sea long, I think... Freshen up his alarm, but I think he pulled that back himself, so it wasn't yeah. destroyed, yeah, yeah. but... Yeah, you're suspicious of the flank coming through. Destrian, good for the trade, and they'll group up, move in towards Garage. They've already picked off another. 
The site's actually going to be theirs. Still two smokes for Boo? Two stars, at least, to play with. Where are those going to... I mean, they're going to be pivotal. They can actually block off this space, especially with the drone already used. Oh, this could be huge. The first is going to go Aslan's way, but they need to deny that defuse. It's halfway. Two HP. Two I HP, was... low time, and so much utility. This is done. A delay as well. You could sort of see Destrin. Oh, I thought there might be a knife coming out there, but a couple of members of Big Die just util in. Well, that's attack for free. A couple Ew. here for Beck. You all right? That might allow his teammates to get a bit of damage done. Dreamass is on Gong as well. There's two low players that he could just chip away at. They know exactly where he is, and Destrian is backing off a little bit, trying to take more attention. Molsey, Sheriff, you can expect a couple more with him. And Boo is just running at people. He's so low health, but the right clicks are working, and so are these classics. Two players. A third guy he's going to start to get suspicious of. 20 on the clock, but the London United have to be careful here. Recon dies available in eight seconds. It's a nice stun to just put him up a little bit. Boo is such low health. Takes the attention away from Destrian. A real nice thrifty. <laughs> All things considered for London United. Pretty much breaks that confidence from big footsteps and try and re -peak. He still has the dash available. Gets a pick onto Aslan. Close on short. Have been spotted. But uh, there's not really any room for Big to maneuver back. They've only got 20 true. seconds left. They've got to run forward. And, well, they can't even do so. Destrian is the one running forward. Running at the attackers. And indeed, Dreamass was covering the flank. He's the kind of player that just throws out a rolling thunder. Bar none, he's not waiting for... Well, I need to line it up here and get the timing right. He's just like, I'm sending it right now. I got a kill over... It's worth it, really. It, it's, the impact hasn't quite been there. And right now, London United are just cutting through big like knife through butter. It's so easy on this defense to get this space. Spike down, see. I truly surprised look like two different tiers of teams this far. Oh god, Molsey! He won't even let Aslan dash into the side, he's taking him down! And with a just twist and left alive, yeah, the surprise killed Joy. Well, he'll get a fight against Dream at last, and finally the flank is caught. The punish is there, but the spike is down on the side. And Corner, now with this base, I feel like London are gonna be sure with 10 seconds left. Twiston, he's gotta check this right, surely. He has to. Yeah, and he will! Oh, 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 oh. He's even gotten the first! Big task, the pistol's already kicked off, and look at Aslan, he's on the site, but his teammates are being picked apart as they try to cross over. They've already lost out on the man advantage. Caspa is super low on HP, and they still haven't dealt with Dream As they try to. A player comes in from heaven. The damage traded out. Op knocks down Caspa. Soon to follow, you would have thought. And although he does go eventually, there's an opportunity for Gobby if that fragment hadn't landed right on his heel. That's what's yeah, <laughs> like, yeah, yeah. I'll give you everything I have, please. I don't Hello. have a billion dollars, sadly. I'm but not uh, lie. I missed a pizza slice. Oh, Destrian, yeah. uh, they're all pushing him. Casper was just holding the angle. It's such a difficult thing for Astros to do. Dreamass manages to sneak away on one HP, able to try and heal. He's going to try and clear out Dreamass in this corner, but he's still holding. He might still be able to get a kill here, but no, Aslan's there to try and... Entire big team is coming to this site. Both players stacked down below. Okay, okay Boo! Done a fantastic job. He's out of ammo, down to the classic. Not much. They're still it's solid. That is a no. Oh, that's not where you want to be. Oh, God. They're going to go into Casper here. They're thinking about that push. The flash has just about caught him. And they've seen him. They saw that little glow of the flash around his head. Peeking up it. above. Nice easy kill for them as we move in towards the B site. Look at the train of big players on their way. They've spotted... Indeed, they know there's two players on B, but they don't know about Boo. Having already made it to spawn, he cuts Aslan off. And Big are even going to commit the Rolling Thunder to this. This is heavy commitment. Good results for it. We now end up in a 2v2 with that res. Not really possible. And Malsey has to give up this control, surely. Where are they going? <laughs> Where are they going? There's this whole scenic route around Split so far, but they've made their way onto the back of the B site. The Chaos is still alive to get that information to the point that Obnox has to spray him down in the end, I think. It's one of these awkward things where, like, BQ now. Two versus one. Clean up onto Big. I think they overthought that a little bit. Like, they panicked. They certainly in that Vent's position. I found at the dash into one. It's a nice kill onto Boo. Oh. But the Boom Bot. Down, Feels like mid. it's picked up more kills than any of the big players so far. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, Ryan, you're savage, dude. What the hell? Well, at least I hope they're not going to just send Destry into his death. Instead, they send Malsey to go and claim some heads. Although he's surely not making it out of there. That showstopper could do massive damage, but he's pressured far too much to really be able to get any angle with it. He'll only barely escape with his life. He's not got a sky flash or a recon dart to get intel. 
One flash left. They know it's a BX egg. This is nasty. If Moles, oh my, he's even gotten a kill on nine left. HP. Now they'll just crossfire it. They were just hoping that somebody else would try and push through in that timing. But speaking of timing, Twiston's found the A site open, but there's no time to rotate over there. But it's pulled everybody from London to that. They think it's a fake. They did indeed. That's why we saw Malsi was even running into spawn with knife out. And that allowed for the lurk to come through and take down the full HP. I was watching it, but as soon as that zero point came in that I mentioned. Well, they've got their four to two score line. It's not completely out of their hands just yet. And Twiston, well, he's showing up on this roll that, again, not really what we're used to seeing him in. A lot of pressure coming towards the B site right now, and Malsi's good to pick up the first. That deters anyone from big from running out before they get that rolling thunder in. They want the space for free. Boo almost gets caught. He's out for more, and Caspa's gone. Great damage by Boo as he continues to frag, and Big are being stopped in his choke point. Double peek from up above again comes through, and when Boo eventually pinks by himself. A lot of presence towards this side of the map for Fecu to deal with. He has some really good timing creeping up through, but he's being spotted. The trap wire up above triggered, giving away the information. They're inside of heaven. That's very much known, but they're also in mid, and Caspa's tearing London apart over there. Becky does well to find the one, but will they still commit towards him? I'm not. He knows they're coming. 14 as the showstopper's popped, and he's going to run this all the way down, but there comes the peak from Jen, and he can't even land it. She's up in the air. Aslan with a big brain play. Scouting out the site, making sure he couldn't possibly be dealt with for it. Caspa on for the ace, really. What a round from this guy. Oh, but he's going to be stolen away from. Still, six to three. Big have picked up the round. Aggressive execute. Double take to try and catch Molesy. The stage roll is going to buy a bit of time. Manages to augment, actually. It's not in a weakened state. Destrian now holding in the judge in the smoke. Gets caught out. Uh, Dream Mask wanted to sort of back up a little bit. Slow Orb is perfectly timed to catch on to forward. Looking to get aggressive into the faces of their opponents. And that's exactly what they do with Aslan falling. The Cosmic Divide put into play. And this is going to maybe cause some problems if they're worried about that flank coming through. But two players are inside of mid. Boo. Twiston. That's a little bit of info on that. Yeah, Twiston's got a great spot. Oh, that's perfect. No hot Got a stun as well that comes in. Perfectly timed from God B. He's even put a camera in the defender spawn. He was over there originally. I thought he was going to press in behind. And try Land still running up there. He had the Vandal. And it's not something you want to see from players. Because why would you need a Vandal when you can... Could be insanely costly. Oh my god. Malsi is so brave. The kind of pings he's going for right now. You can tell that he's leading the scoreboard by quite a bit. Because you don't have the confidence to just run up a rope like that. And try to take the duel. When you're in a 4v5, unless you're uh, already having a pretty good game. Well Cosmic Divide used on the defense. 50 seconds left, so there is a chance for Big to, to reset. But Manjit sneaking on through. Twist and thought that he maybe had a bit more space to work with. But no, Malsi in the same position he was in before. Aslan now, two versus four. Manages to make it a bit more costly. This freight train of four players over on London United making their way. No utility to give this away that they've got the space, right? Like Big... This could all just be a bait, it's just a smoke so they've got to work off and Boo punishes that, takes out Aslan who's playing a bit more aggro. Nice. And this is so much space for free that London United have been able to take a big struggling to read it, I think. Well, it's exactly the same as what we saw in Haven though, right? I mean, that was the, the key thing for the big defensive side, if you summed it up, was just like clueless, lost. I don't know what word you'd want to use, but it, it would be something along those lines. They didn't have control over the map for more than 10 seconds after the barriers came up. Then there would be London United stealing it back, getting a player into a nasty position, or faking out and running into a kind of seat. Pure team playing, playing for each other that's coming in. <laughs> I, as I was saying, as happens. I'm still a little bit concerned as they move towards the safe zone. See if they can get a peek in, but no, Casper's on that pretty perfect angle. Obnox is going to peek out in a nice spot. Just losing one, I think is big. Obnox getting all four of those kills as well. I think more so. See that? I think Twisted's camera did spot the players actually pushing through mid, like just a, a, a gap oh, yeah. between the smoke and the wall, right? And Aslan's there, prepared and waiting. Nice 2k, London United. That's what I wanted to see, right? Like big getting information that London aren't privy to, and then having that information standing. just used and exploited against London United. Like that's just a stonewall defense. Now, Boo could be like pretty much just one kill on the side from London United in two rounds. This could be a, a flawless big, which would be huge, I think, for the money. 
most definitely yeah building it up in this early stage sure it, it's only gonna be the one ball. walk right into twisting oh he's sprayed oh, no. a little too early but he'll still get a double how has he gotten away with that and then running through the cosmic oh my god the grab well on the floor and he ran oh well <laughs> so is feck you thankfully he walks out with his back turned this should be nice and easy destrian sure he'll survive the first op shot but how much more can be found with 15 seconds left no, going to B ain't really going to be an option. Ten seconds left. He's going to play for the damage. This is not even time to get a plant anymore. Are they going to let him live? No, no they're most certainly not. And three out of five of these players, Hopnox has managed to make his way over towards heaven. He sat on the catwalk undetected. Good timing to start with. No one's cleared him. And now oh, no. he'll spray down two. Oh, no. As Casper emerges from the site, Gabi comes to join him. And big kills tend to follow, right? It's it's kind of like a that first engagement is so important because multiple players go down in these fights. Another showstopper usage here that finds nothing again. Malsy really not getting any value out of that ulti. We're going to see the attempt to take the site control, but the problem, they're running right back in. They know there's a player isolated on the back side. Destrian is dealt with. And although Fakyu does his very best, they can push to an overtime if they find two rounds in a row. Their cash is absolutely ruined, though. I mean, this is big home free, surely. Two chances to close this out and bring us all the way to Breeze. Am I right in remembering that the only two rounds that London got on their attack were the pistol and the fall guide? Like, London United have ultimates to work with, but Boo going down so early. But Gobby's got here in time, and he will not win. And that is not the kill. Twisted running in through the smoke, though, will take Destrian down. This guy is actually a madman. He just does not stop. He does not respect. 5v3 as they look to close this out. Molsi's putting in his best performance, but it's going to be even better. Three players left to deal with after that double kill. Dreamass does his best. The nade down slows them for a second, but Molsi falls and Dreamass is to do it all with 63 HP. It's not to be 13 to 10 for big. They will bring us all the way to Breeze. It's on utility. I'm in through the cage. We go. Dreamass is just taking the fight all the way to them. Copy doing a damn good job though. Shock dart through. Looks like Dreamus has made it away, but not with all of his health. Fiku's going back oh! for more. They're just walking into big at this point. They're happy to take it. They've got the players over there to fight for the jewels, but also a completely open B site. Aslan's pushed all the way into arches. Dreamass, that's a six shot from distance with the headhunter, but still a two versus three. Dreamass down to pretty low HP and a lot of mid control. Nobody's even on the site for big. They're all in mid. Yeah, and look at that. Boo's about to be completely blindsided, right? There's no way he expects Obnox in that corner. Why would he? With that plant nice and open. <laughs> and indeed, no headhunter for Dreamass. I think this round is... Uh, I'm ready to call time of death on it. They're running it down with the utility. And then the triple swing's gonna... Well, not even. Just got B. Side with a few pistols. Looking to take a little bit of a uh, group approach to it. Again, one of the issues. You know, that Viper wall goes up on the A side. It's very hard to... Really get anything done about it. Obnox is still running forward to take duels, which is brave considering the HP he's on. And at this point, I, I maybe get a little bit worried. You know what, Big? There we go. That's a recovery. That is one hell of a recovery by that slime. Gonna try to finish it off here. Body shot needed and found. Really nice. Four rifles in a cave are handy. Player with a marshal could go off and do whatever he wants at this point, but still, Casper is the one that goes down. BQ still on this angle. Dream is there to join him, just spraying on through. London United. Just holding an angle, not pressured away. And now Aslan is just the one alive with the marshal. Gets one. Can't quite find a follow-up this time. I think... It's Storm, we talked about it earlier, being almost online. Aslan's going to use it to bridge the gap here. Few players having rifles on the attack, and Gobby's one of them. Already opened it up with a strong start. Molsey's in through the snake bite. This, this guy is actually just the most aggressive player on the planet. I don't know why he always goes through utility, and I don't know how he always finds success with it. We're left back into just twisting. One versus three, wall up to try and block out that operator, but it's only going to keep him back so long, and the spike still needing to be planted. 45 HP, toxins down, absolutely everything going against Twist in here, and while well, we conclude it with that, just about any Astra play on this map, any of you, and how it's going to work. Uh, that was nothing to do with Astra. Uh, that was a wall bind. Nice, easy. Well, well all right, I'll knock. It's supposed to be easy openings. It's apparently far easier than it looks. 
They have rolled over this site and left London United with practically no control. These guys are actually just at the back of the site, but they couldn't do anything to stop these crosses. Nice opening by Boo. At least an opportunity. Yeah, that's a hard shot to hit when a player is moving that quickly across. Caspe now on an aggressive angle to peak. They even actually sky flash just to check that there's nobody pushing in through nest in mid. So now Boo in a one versus two. Mantis to scope up a bit closer. Catches Ooh. up, knocks. The recon dart and the suppression don't get him. That's a ping though. God B, he's so good in these clutches. Snake bite's gonna force him off of that plan at the very least. He peeks out to one side, gets onto the other. He's vulnerable, but Boo now wants to crack oh. open the pace. That's a lovely right click. Think, but look at how much London are ready to constrict on this. Nice snake bite down. It's gonna stop plant over towards the back of the site. Malsi has been getting so aggressive. When I see him approach that wall, I know this guy's playing the sky. I can already see him pushing through, but he's spraying to find that shot. An operator affect you for another, and this is a dominant shutdown. Oh, this is exactly where you start to get a little bit worried. If you're big coming into this round with rifles, though, they've already looking at it from Boo's perspective. He can maybe fight at the start, but I don't expect to see him stick around all too aggressively until he has those players rotating to help. Yeah, look at all of that utility that's been used on the execute. And Mulsi is still the one that gets that kill, right? And Boo, not afraid to try and fight. This is a bit more of a problem, though, with that Viper's Pit. The Seekers is dedicated to try and really put these players under pressure. <gasps> that is such a nice crunch from London United. You sort of assume that Big should have that straightforwardly, but now it's just got to be alive in a one versus three. They know where he is. They even bait. See, destroy them again and again. Got to give credit to Boo for the, first of all, staying alive every round, but also the utility placement and stopping certain plant locations and controlling these players. Pushing forward with an op like this is dangerous. Fecu's in a lot of trouble and he's dropped immediately. Aslan still is trying to go in for those fights. Three must behind again. It's around where Gobby's picked up the operator. They've picked up guns. It was an eco anyway for big. Thrifty. They'll take it. London United didn't dedicate too much. They just went down. They forced out ultimates. It yesterday as well when it comes to icebox the same Whoa. idea now aslan again press no b because the utility can still go up if this is an a exec and it will be because this is where god b likes to go yeah that's actually so smart and a really good spot there ryan oh god death stream <laughs> he was full blind the whole time he's been tagged now and dealt with the res can come through they've got to be quick in getting back in here and stopping opnox from being Revived and they're they can't. I mean, there's no one even remote. Mostly close by, but Gobby's gone down. Malsi from the other side of the bloody map has managed to take him down through a smoke that is ridiculous. <laughs> Just sneak, sneak in a little bit as well. Ah, this, this one's not going their way at all. Good crop for London United. Yeah, he brought up the ultimate too to go on. Fiku is not afraid to push here. This it a couple of times, but I don't know the big have really spotted it. And that's what if he doesn't, well, he's got late round elbow and mid flanks of these players as they try to push up i don't know where aslan thought he was but i don't know that he thought he was exposed to that angle looks like everybody on big is being caught completely off the shots there onto twiston he knows he's surrounded by three different people he's got two different operators pointing at him now as well i think that was probably the, <laughs> the biggest deal you know that that we had from the Astros so far play with but at this point that gamble is is going to be the right call and the utility used <gasps> also got caught on the way back I, I... I'm a little bit perplexed on that one. Destry and almost out of ammo will be dealt with. And the site is now theirs. Three versus three. Trying to make their way through. Dream Mask just teleporting out. Forcing a bit more utility out. Got B, who has nothing left and also goes down. Fiku is pushing aggressively all the way from A cave to wrap the entire way around. Now two versus two. Dream Mask is now in at Arches. Aslan, he has to make it big here. The plant is down. He doesn't know where the Viper is right now, though. And also the chamber could just TP away to anywhere. That's always the, the downside, right? Having a player like this who you give them the space, they can just disappear instantly. Oh, the blade storm's not landed. Not gone well for Aslan, but he's got a rifle to play with. The snake bite stepped inside of, and only for the fact that he fell down those steps, I think Boo would have been a goner. But thankfully, that little thing saved their life. The Viper's pit is even going to be put there to stop them. Oh, I, I didn't see that fight going Big's way, to be honest. It's double it's swing. Just a good house. Yeah, that is a, a huge bit of impact on the push through. Big have lost a lot of their utility, but they haven't hadn't lost a lot of their players until now. With Gob B picking up Boo, we'll be able to at least get this plant down into the one versus two. We said Destrian's impact had been well questionable so far, but there you go.
whether it's the Astra or not. A lot of people up in holes, and they are expecting this to be a bit more of a split. Aslan, snake bit in that corner. And look at this aggression from Fiku, jumping on top of the yellow box, but it's Destrian that gets all of the follow-up. Obnox is down too, leaving Twiston to perform a pretty big clutch. Yeah, indeed, this is uh, feeling like it'll be done. Depends where they plant that spike, but with spawn control, there's no reason for them to plant for cave. And they've even got the info. There you go. Twiston's gone. Delivered. Berlin International Gaming, on the other hand, much more passive. They're chilling out. Unfortunately, they've lost Aslan right away. Obnox tries to trade. The players are already flash play through the wall. But really, they've got to force these engagements soon. Players are starting to surround them completely to encircle them. Twiston does a damn good job spraying in through the wall, but it's not over yet. London United are fighting for this tooth and nail. They've already seized the site, but there's a player on the other side. Kaspa has given away his position. The shots are not landed. Now he's being pressured. A headshot from Molsi's not enough. 140. Kaspa survives on the backside. And now, what can Boo do? How do you get this plant? They're just going to run it down. He has to try to force these duels. Making his way around the back of the side. There it is. He's caught twisting off guard. Casponi is a fraction of HP left. But so does Boo. 13 seconds and he'll get it done. So smart. The fourth kill finally found the... going to do? And I'm off by like, by like 10 decisions. It's just whatever the crit. How did he win that? They were aware completely, and sure, yeah, God B does well to find one, but we need another hero to step up. So much more damage needs to be done. Twiston getting inside of that orb. Oh, and he's walked right out in front of Malsy. That's It's been a, a tough old time, really, and just big. Uh, it seems that they really can't get things together. Like, I am very excited for Navi Liquid tomorrow because of how Navi made London United look so problematic. Did they have this kind of response? And it's not like Big are just doomed to be relegated. After United, they're running into actually two players on the backside. Oh, they've got the information now to play with, though. This is going to be... Oh, no! The right-click flash from Obnox, but he's only good for one. Now it's Casp on the back of the site that they'll look to take down. And they've wall done bang. so easily with a wall bang. I don't know why I said that's a surprise. Wall bang, like wall bang. That's not a thing. Obnox, yeah, he's just going to go down in the Viper's pit. Any information he could get is just going to be smothered Ooh. away and... Two versus two now. This is such Ten a seconds. difficult retake, but there's still an attempt to stop the plant at the very least. <gasps> oh no! Destrian! He's nasty, but no. hold on! If he can just run in there and stop the plant, no boost right out to him!